Hello my dear friends welcome back to my channel my name is Vas and in today's video I am going to introduce to you a unique Indian custom which I'm sure many foreigners have never got a chance to experience uh, it's about death and the transition into uh, the different world the next world so guys many of you are not aware uh, that people of northwestern India especially uh, Rajasthan Haryana Punjab Sindh uh, have long lifespan especially the people uh, from the remote villages live longer mostly 90 to 100 years uh, this is one similarity between uh, the Japanese and the Indian but uh, you won't find uh, much Guinness Book records is because people in the villages are not empowered and they don't really care about registering themselves in the Guinness Book of World Records but the fact remains that uh, people in northwestern India uh, have long lifespan and um, especially because the soil is enriched with uh, minerals and um, they uh, most of them are vegetarians so they stay away from animal product and you know the combination of enriched vitamin enriched vegetables their diet their lifestyle you know all these are factors for uh, their long lifespan and it is believed in uh, the northwestern india that uh, if a person dies of old age uh, in the sense uh, lives long like 90 years more than 90 years so before I introduce this custom to you, I want to show you a clip. <laughs> the clip that you just saw was not from any festivals in India uh, it was actually a, a, a custom after the funeral and it is believed if a person dies of old age like uh, he or she has lived a long life like almost 90 or above and have seen their grandchildren uh, being born like in the sense not literally being born like they have seen their grandchildren uh, come to this world uh, it is believed that they uh, they will go to heaven they have achieved uh, the salvation and they will be uh, going to heaven and they will get um, golden steps uh, to climb up to heaven so you know people from the villages and the relatives neighbors all gather together and the song they are dancing on uh, is not a joyful song it is uh, the song uh, that is waking you know the lyrics of the songs are dedicated to the Hindu gods and goddesses uh, they are waking up the gods and goddesses to bless their uh, grandparent uh, who has uh, for who, who could uh, transition into the next world uh, peacefully without any trouble so they're praying to God and they are rejoicing that their grandparents have uh, achieved uh, salvation and will be stepping up the golden ladder and uh, reaching heaven and so uh, after the funeral it this uh, this uh, dance uh, goes on for almost uh, for 13 days and um, after 13 days uh, they again pray to god and there's there are some customs that they fulfill and then they uh, you know call then people gather together they complete the ceremony a completion happens after 13 days so uh, this is one unique culture uh, i don't know if any of you uh, knew about it but uh, there is a belief like this so uh, this is one unique culture i wanted to introduce to you today and uh, let's uh, check out some other clips <laughs> So 
as India has varied cultures, uh, landscapes, you know, uh, different kinds of people, different uh, languages, everything is, uh, everybody has some unique uh, things to offer. So I, this is just a small attempt uh, on my part to introduce to you uh, the culture of India and, um, you know, the unique ones. So if you uh, want you can check out my playlist it's not a long playlist I have made a playlist on uh, India which has uh, not my many videos but you know uh, a holy a festival holy festival uh, that is played uh, in Haryana with water and a stick to beat up the people and uh, also about my Rajasthan Jaipur trip so do check it out if you would be interested in India and see you in my next video take care bye bye <laughs>